Is this working? Is this working? Oh my goodness, I hope it is. It says I'm public. It says, oh, it says I'm live. Oh, that's exciting. Okay, cool. Can I see comments? Can I see comments? Chat. Connecting to the chat. Oh, hello, Diclonius, Babatak TV, Ruben, hello, hello. Gosh, it is working. All of a sudden, I feel very warm. Ow. Just hit this building next to me. Yes, I'm on my mobile phone. How delightful, how delightful. I hope you can hear me all right. I hope you can see me. I don't want to be Gilroy Lockhart or anything, but, you know. Can you all hear me? Can you all see me? Excellent. Um, so, yes. Okay, it's been confirmed that you can. That is marvellous indeed. So I am currently on my phone. I hope you can kind of... I know it will look very different to usual, but I hope it is better than last week. So that is just what we're going with right now. I am in what is effectively, legitimately, a bombshell of a city room. It is upsetting. It is terrible. <sighs> shall we show you? We shall show you. For the live stream people, you know, you've got to, you've got to really just give you the behind the scenes of the absolute diabolical state the city is in right now. I worked in it today and I was like, yes, I feel good. I'm going to work on a city and like get this thing in shape and then it all fell apart and it didn't work and now my city is in a worse state than it was before and uh i have got some ideas about things that i want to integrate but problematically 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 Tr diff diff difficulty hmm i can't find a word the word that i'm looking for some means something along the lines of annoyingly I need loads of parts and I need lots of like time and um, possibly help and sanity, none of which I have a lot of. <laughs> so um, I don't know what is going to happen to the city at the moment. I am feeling mildly annoyed with it because it's just not coming together in the way that I want it to. And ah, uh, uh, <laughs> but such is life, I guess. What What is good is I have whiskey from my scotland trip which actually to be really honest i have finished mostly which is very sad and i have a set to build that i didn't grab in time hold up Ooh. i have a set to build hell yeah so originally the plan for the sit for this sit it's gonna be a great stream isn't it guys um originally the uh plan for the set is that it's going to be a mock so i wanted to kind of make this into a grocery store somewhere in the city as the city is such a big question mark right now, we'll just have to see what happens. Anyway, um, Ilka von der Kamp says, hello everybody, very curious about your plan with the supermarkets. I have, I'm not short of plans. The plans are not the problem. The problem is time, it is money, it is sanity. I have very little of any of those. Um, nice that you have. Thank you. Shall we open it? Let's let's open this. Oh, it has push tabs. I can take my frustration out in this box. Okay, that was very satisfying. I'm glad you were all here to witness it. Um, <laughs> hey Wesley, how are you doing? Christian M, hello. Just a really quick thing. I am on my mobile phone, so I can see the comments, but they are very small. Um, so if I miss anybody, I'm sorry. You're all very, very welcome. And you're all, it's all a delight to have you here for sure. But also very sorry if I don't say hi, because I'm struggling seeing everybody. All right, the box is open. We have this book for bag one to build the vehicles, which are probably the things I'm least interested in. Look how tiny that car is. Is it like a smart, obviously it's a smart car, but like legitimately that is, I, I want to say pathetic, but like, you know how everybody's been like, oh, you know, like the the speed champions car eight wide. I wish it was six wide. This car's four wide. It's tiny, hardly fits one person anyway. And then bags three till four shall build me this marvelous, like this marvelous screen. I can see your comment, ODJ. Um, <laughs> it pops up separately. And then we have a bag with two road plates. Actually, no, with one road plate. 
one 16 by 16 plate and one 8 by 16 plate, which is great because they're super useful. So I'm very glad about that. That is what the store sits on. And we have our four bags. Can I just say, four bags, not very much. So we shall build the tiny little vehicles first. Yes, let's build the tiny vehicles first. I'll see if I can put you somewhere where you can actually see both myself and... No, because if I put you further away, you can't see any of the comments. Said, hello, been a long time. Declonius, boss man, what's up? What's up, boy? Right. Loud. So in this bag, we have, ooh, shiny. Also, yeah, don't mind this. I have just uh, grated some cheese, um, which didn't go very successfully. I grated my finger. I didn't notice. I mean, I knew it hurt, but I was like, oh, well, it's just a bit stingy. And then the cheese started turning red and I was like, huh, not quite what I was going for there. It is not quite Halloween yet. So I had to put a plaster on it. But I have a like torso of a minifigure, which is on the new sort of like ye neon yellow thing. And it looks super cool and shiny and I like it. Um, we have some big forklift truck things. We have a brick separator, which, you know, in a set with four bags, essential, of course. Um, good morning from Australia. Hello, good morning. I hope you are good. There's a uh, there's Xavier Nuga. Hello, all. Hello, red cheese is best cheese. <laughs> I'm sorry, yes, I'm sure. Um, that I mean, it wasn't what I was going for. I'm gonna be honest with you, so. You know, I was I was slightly shocked at the at the uh, unintentional uh, creation, shall we say? Right. So here's the first minifigure of this set. She's the forklift driver. She is pretty basic, but she has the new sort of torso, which is exciting. Very nice. Okay, head hair combo always good. Quite a nice face as well. Dual molded, which is excellent. And then we have then we have the very like pot oh his mustache isn't black his mustache actually like brown wow that's more detailed than i thought he was so here we have the, sh the grocery shop man oh but then the mustache is brown but it doesn't match his hair but we have got this lovely little gentleman who will serve you in the store i like how he still has like more than like you needed to detail on the back like they could have just made that completely tan but they gave his t-shirt like actually like a what do you call it He's wearing a shirt with like a tartan pattern or like a checker pattern. I'm really glad that they did that because that makes him slightly cooler. So yay, Lego. Um, Ulrika Tyson, hello, hello, hello. Um, oh, Tyson donated $5. pre bridge swear jar since I'm on mute and can't hear anything. Oh no, thank you, Tyson. Ulrika, can you thank Tyson on my behalf? Thank you. Um, so he says, will you collect the Disney 100 CMF series that is apparently coming next year? Um, I haven't actually heard that rumor yet. That is very exciting. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised, obviously. There is quite a lot of brickheads planned for the 100th like, year anniversary of Disney. So, like, we're definitely going to see quite a lot of cool Disney stuff. I'm expecting, because of, like, because the castle's retiring, I'm expecting, like, a nice new big Disney set as well. But... I haven't heard the CMF rumor yet. That's exciting. I'm I I am very down for that. Can you can you guys just confirm that you can't see the comments over the top of my face? That's just me that can see those because I'm on my phone and I've turned my comments on so I can actually see what you guys are saying. But they go over my face and I just want to make sure that you guys don't see that because that must be a bit annoying. Um. So yes. <laughs> Thank you, Ulrika. Um, Ruben says, do you have a whiskey for me? I, I am currently... So we went to Scotland um, over the weekend because Ben had an event there and I was like a freeloader and just came along. And I went into a whis I went into the distillery of my favourite whiskey and then I was there too late and the bar had just closed and like I completely missed out and I didn't even get a taster when I was in the distillery. I honestly was so disappointed and really quite sad. Yes, I didn't plan it very well. We had one day. I honestly emergency put some stuff together, but oh, to have missed out was really quite 
annoying because it's like quite it's very far it's like eight hours from where i live so it's not like i'm gonna be back anytime soon but i went into another posh whiskey shop where the guy obviously did not regard us at all because we did not look like people who were going to spend 1300 pounds on a wine which is what he was selling and a whiskey of like 600 quid and stuff but we bought the 20 pound three whiskey pack and this is very nice it's, i think it's singleton it is very very smooth kerry hello hello very good. Oh, is it out of sync? Oh, I don't know. Salutations. Salutations, madam. <laughs> um, anyway, I haven't seen anybody say if they can see the comments or not. We'll see. But she said, Johanna, you're a little out of sync on the sound. I don't know why. Like, I'm using my phone. It's the same input. Um... Admittedly, I'm here and like my phone is here, so it's quite a far way to travel, but I wouldn't say that would be any uh, any uh, thing that would put out of sync, that would be honest. Uh, no comments on my face. Thank you, Saeed, for confirming. That is good to know. Excellent. Fantastic. So I can still see. Great. It's all going well. Right. Let me build these very fancy vehicles, you know, guys. I am, you know, going to just ditch that Aston Martin Speed Champions build that I built the other day and just... Just gonna go with this beautiful smart car because way nicer, obviously. And we're starting with the produce, of course. Ooh, okay. Unsure what it's meant to be because we're having we're using red. What are they meant to be? Oh my god! Picking things up with my placid finger is not easy. <laughs> that was pathetic effort. What are these meant to be? They're like red, but like with, with one of those stems in it. What are these? Because they're a bit too big for tomatoes, I'm sorry. Would, would be grateful to know, thank you. Okay, we have built this very intense build. That was very much, that took it out of me, I have to be honest. Anyway, I think I'm I'm ready for the next bit. Okay, let's, let's build the car, shall we? Like, whew just about recovered let's build this tiny mini smart car which is kind of adorbs hashtag adorbs dun, 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 dun. my and brian hello brick built city hello oh my god i don't see that many comments at the same time so it's really hard to see what people say we have the future gam but instead future sound what is going on this is so annoying this is exactly what i thought to prevent if i were to stream on my phone because it's both my camera and my phone sound, so that seemed like that it should be sync, right? But oh well. Are we building the retired supermarket? I mean, it's not retired yet here anyway, but yes, we're building this, um, which is very exciting. So honestly, um, it's not retired here whatsoever. It's available on lego.co.uk, so don't worry, guys, but it seems to be sold out temporarily, at least, if not permanently, in the US. And whether or not it's retiring is currently slightly up for debate, um, as I've heard conflicting accounts. <laughs> uh, retirement. Retirement. Do you know what I am not getting before it retires? The Disney castle. I have decided officially that it's beyond my means and beyond my wishes, and therefore I shan't... Huh, is this where the stickers are? Is this secret box where the stickers are? Oh no, it's very secret. There is a secret rubber band. My, my, my. <laughs> Where are the stickers then? It says you stickers. I'm like, uh, yeah, I could. Ah, there they are. They are tiny. Okay, they're not, that's not that many stickers. Yee. Right, let's attach this number plate. JM60347. I'm assuming those are the designer's initials and then it's set number. So let's attach this marvellous little thing. Oh, okay. Okay. Attached! Um, Carrie Brooks... Kerry says, I very nearly bought the Disney train, and st uh, train on Saturday, but somebody bought it for 
bought it before me. I'm kind of glad about that. Oh my gosh, that was so close. I mean, they had it, they had two of them in that store in Sheffield, um, Carrie. You know, the, like, the independent one. That one had two when I was there. I mean, I didn't inquire about the price because, huh, probably not. It wasn't really on my wonder list, but yeah, they had two. I think I sent you a video at the time. Um... I did not decide to get the Disney Castle. No, I've decided not to get it. I, I've been pondering about it for a long time. I've been kind of, like, it's kind of been, like, on a back burner of, like, oh, maybe I'll get it eventually, but I just don't think it's realistic. I'm not getting it. I'm not attached to it enough, and it's just too much money. So I'm not getting a castle. But I'm excited to see what they'll bring out to replace it. That is for sure. Right. Let's attach the second. I hate it when you have to attach stickers like in the middle of a piece that's bigger because getting it wrong is like so, I'm so likely to F it up. <laughs> F it up. I'm sure F it up is like the correct terminology. Now we need a grill piece. Wonderful. And some backlights. Guys, can we just say the most beautiful broken oops <laughs> tiny little car it's not done obviously but um and then we get this on here oh my god stop breaking the thing you're building johanna you silly goose thank you da -dum -da -dum -da -dum -dum. Uh, people are talking about what things are with prices and uh things look expensive though i've lost the track of what it is slightly mm, 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 mm. let's add some little tiny wheels to this beauty oh, attaching axles into like the lego rubber wheels Ow. yes interesting it's an interesting thing okay attached attached i haven't I can't remember the last time I had a Lego set nude I had tyres in. I feel like something recently had tyres. What was it? I mean, I built the Aston Martin, actually, so that was a car. Wait, oh, Ben Wilkinson! Good day, sir. How do you do? How is Fair Devon treating thee? All right, this is the car that I've just built. Like, wow. So posh. Oh, I don't have the Aston Martin near me because I would really like to compare them, but it is a baby. You're so tiny. You could you could you Okay, right, I'm done now. Actually I was gonna say I'm done being weird, but let's be honest. Never Anyway, let's go and build the forklift truck. Just tie Ooh look, it's a one by two one of these printed warning things. I've only ever had the one by fours. That's exciting. Well, Ladies and gentlemen, if that isn't exciting, I don't know what is. What a thrilling day indeed. All right. Love your mo mood tonight, Jan. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. What shall we say? It comes from the liquor of the gods, you know. <laughs> Quite. Hmm. Anyways, let me continue this amazing forklift build because I'm sure you're just as like me dying to see what it will look like it comes with like this really cool piece so there is the forklift thing at the front and then the lift thing itself these are very big lego pieces and are actually really quite impressive I I'm pretty like come on that's quite cool that's that, that's very specialist Anybody in the chat that knows, has Lego, like, used those pieces before? Or, like, were they custom made for the set? Like, tell me. Because if they were made for the set, that must have made the set pretty expensive. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's fine. I thought I was missing a piece, but turns out I'd already attached it. <laughs> I saw the orange... Uh, the purple comment. Um, right. There we go. Stato, hello, how are you doing? 
Hope you are doing marvellously. Anyway, how's everybody's weeks been going? It's been odd to realise that the clocks are changing like this weekend. Apparently summer is over. I mean, it's felt like it's been over for this month at least. But it's like going to be November. Can we just all take a moment to, to just... Yeah, November. November is indeed nearly upon us. I am just as sugar as you will be. Um, that means that spooky season is nearly over, but that means that autumn will continue very, um, with conviction. Um, which is good because I like autumn. And also Christmas is coming. I know, I know, I said it. Oh my gosh, I did it. But how amazing. Christmas is coming. I need to start thinking what I want for Christmas. It's going to be Lego, by the way, if anybody wondering. Lego. That is the only thing that shall make me happy. May actually, maybe some Pokemon. Maybe some Pokemon fuck Funko Pops. That would be... <laughs> that was a really terrible, like, mis misspeaking. Um, yeah, Funko Pops of Pokemon are also really good. Forbidden Planet currently has Pichu, and I really bloody want it. Ah, but I was very good, and I resisted. I went to the Forbidden Planet in Glasgow on Sunday, and they have a huge Chewbacca, like a huge Chewbacca Funko Pop. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a vlog of my adventure, and it was super amazing. Simon says, with the lag under Hannah's voice, it's like watching an old spaghetti western lol. I can't believe there's a lag. Like, I don't know why there would be a lag. Guys, anybody with technical knowledge, like, why the hell would there be a lag? I'm streaming with my phone. Like, what? Why? When I'm looking at the recording thing, like, it looks in sync. I don't understand. I am not pleased. Why is that always some sort of technical issue? I swear to God, I try so hard, guys. I try so hard. And every single time something comes up that I wasn't anticipating. You have no idea how frustrating that is. Anyways, I shouldn't whinge, but it is. Ugh, really annoying. Right, I'm nearly done with my forklift. I want to attach this really cool forklift bit, okay? Like, come on. I'm gonna get to the cool part. Okay, so this is <laughs> this is our forklift right now. It doesn't, it doesn't look that exciting, but we're gonna be attaching the cool thing. Okay, we're holding this up this way. We're gonna be putting this in this way. Okay, right. Wait, yeah, this way. Do we do we squish it in? What? Oh. I'm stupid, I see. Yes, yes, yes. Cool, that's good to know. Then we attach the rubber band. My there. Rubber band has been attached. Ooh. Oh, and that means you can like pull it down, but then it'll also go back up. This rubber band is not gonna last very long. They should have included the spare. But that's exciting. Okay, cool. Then we're attaching it to the front. So now we have the forklift attached and it can lean back as well. So, you know, you can really cause more danger to thyself. Who does not want that? And then luckily to protect the inhabitant, um, there will be... Huh. That will be this thing. Beep, beep, beep. There we go. That's a very efficient forklift. You can just put your figure in that, protect them, have the forklift. Wow, Bronx, hello. How are you doing? How are you doing today, sir? Okay, so I've, I've finished the forklift and it's telling me how it works as well, but don't worry guys, I'd already figured it out. And because we added that plate at the bottom there, we can just like, it fits like quite nicely in between these things. And then you can like, okay, I'm, that's sorry. I'm sorry, the forklift is quite cute. I'm just, I'm just gonna be honest here. Much adorbs. Okay, amazing, so done. 
Thanks. Thanks for joining me on this amazing adventure. That was the set, guys. See you later. You know, see you, see you next week. Goodbye. No, kidding. Um, <laughs> that was the first book. It was an intense run. What can we say? Now we're gonna go for bag number two. Looks like the same forklift that was in the old freight train set. The rubber band is pretty good. Mine's still old freight train. The one from two years ago? Me no own no freight trains, so I don't know. Ow. Ooh. Mini figure parts. <laughs> mini hips, mini hips, mini, mini, mini. Oh. Okay, so I have these beauties, the new dual molded legs with the prosthetic leg. Very cool. I need to open this thing because I need to actually see how the minifigures go together. At least according to this thing, we need this beautiful new like shirt, which has a very, very amazing pattern on it. Let me see if I can show you properly. Mm, I don't know. Like the... So nice. Okay, cool. Generic man smiley face. Good. Generic man hair. Fantastic. Attached. Um, shopping list to get what he needs. I hope that the descriptions are um, detailed enough. But there we go. I really like this shopping list piece. It's very, very nice. Weep. It's very nice. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Perfect. Um, ooh, okay. Oh my gosh, that's so ingenious. So I just got to build like the lady that is also like the, the, the happy pee thing, promoter, but she has like a normal torso. So if you didn't want like the mascot, you could just have her as a generic citizen. So she is, she you can build her either like this so she can just like be shopping with her family or you can build her like this and then she is the mascot which I think is super smart I'm really glad they did that that's awesome now we need to find the place that she's holding and then we have to attach the be happy thing to it be happy okay it's gonna be in concentration oh Sorry, the bottle nearly fell down. Let's attach this adorable sticker. Ooh, so cute. Time bomb, hello. Ooh, I just dropped. The bottle's are very keen on escaping. Okay. Amaze balls. Oh, so cute she's very adorable okay i'm glad with her i'm happy with her not glad with her so that's five minifigures in total oh look at the shopping cart look at the shopping cart let me find the second bit that's the second wheel there it is look i know it's like a friend's design originally but it's really nice it's so smooth I should probably read some comments for anyone who's built either or even both, which is a better choice for Christmas? The Batmobile Tumblr or the Sanctum Sanctorum? Ooh, those are very varying. I love the Sanctum, honestly. It was a great build. There's a lot of detail in it. Had a really good time. It's a very nice building, but like, have you got buildings? That's probably the main thing. It's good for posing figures on as well. There's lots of options. Um, Tyrum says, greetings. I trust this day finds you well to Tyson. I hope it does too. Bricks the Skew is also commenting on saying that the Sanctum is good. Um, mm -hmm. Gordon says shopping cart exists thanks to friends. Yeah, that's kind of really sad. So it was originally from a friend series. Actually, guys, did you guys hear a rumor of the friend sets for next year? It looks like it may be appealing to more people. I have a speculation. Because they're doing like the next generations of friends, it may have a different colour scheme. That is my speculation. 
which how many people this year have said oh my god i love the friend sets but then it didn't buy it because the colors just didn't work like i for one have loved pretty much every single friend set that they turned out this year but i haven't purchased them because i couldn't really justify spending the money on like basically a bricks pack that i wouldn't use a lot of because they're just too bright for the city that i decided to build i really like my dark orange muted colors so i never really went in for the friend sets and everybody's and a lot of people have been saying that friends lineup has been better than lego city i i've heard rumors and this is also partially my own speculation that maybe we're going to see a different color scheme in the friends sets for next year which is going to be both amazing and terrible because if that's true like i do, i don't have money for like the sets in like the normal lineups that i want like I don't know, if everything is nice how on earth am i going to prioritize it's just a terrible shame so yeah there is that Boop. all right i've built the child i oh there needs to be a banana in the shopping cart there we go banana grapes apple and bread a very healthy and balanced diet indeed I'm very proud of these minifigures right mm. amazing it is now open here we have the shiny shiny base plate the shiny shiny plate and the other shiny shiny plate we're going to be starting this build building a wall that's right far from building walls in our real lives we shall be building them out of lego today good that is good to know i am sprouting an absolute large amount of complete nonsense just quite, quite marvelous really sometimes i take a step back and i'm like woman you've just been online to roughly 50 strangers and have absolutely no filter on that is quite an achievement <laughs> anyway i hope it's amusing or at least minorly so um oh i like these green bricks they are very nice they are much more colorful than the stuff i usually have but it's quite nice quite nice indeed very large amount of plates um grill pieces in this so far so here we go and there we are this book is really difficult like it's not bound the best way it's like lying it open it doesn't really want to it doesn't really want to do what i want it to do Ooh, shiny green tiles very nice very nice there we go and then we have those new like double doors that have been on the pad wall at least in the uk so you can attach god somebody started up the engine and it's like one of those really heavy oops look at me guys i i make noise when i start my car type engines it's very loud there we go beautiful and we're attaching two lime green studs to it to make opening them easier oh and we're adding a sticker that says open i can do it i can do that Oh my god, these doors are really scratched. That's a shame. Okay. They're open. Open for business. How many times does this person have to rev their engine? Oh my god. Please, sir. People are trying to live stream over here. God. Can't you have some sort of sympathy? Raha. Oh, somebody said Johanna. Johanna what? Johanna. Hello! Hello, Hugh! Hello. Um, I don't know, everybody's saying hi. Thomas says, okay, I thought it was crazy. Oh well, we can still hear her live. Okay. How bad is the how bad is the delay? 
How is there a delay? This is actually really pissing me off. It's actually really pissing me off. Not gonna lie. Tried a test stream, tried setting this up. It all worked perfectly. When I go live, it isn't. Good. Good. It's good to know that. That's exactly what we're here for. Da, 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 da. Moments of the magic. Hello. Good time. Good bleh. long time no see. Sorry, that was really not the best way to say hi, but you know what I meant. <laughs> um, oh my god, that's very, it's very bright orange that we're going for here. Hold up, I'll pull it up in a moment. I'm just finishing this stretch of the store where we're apparently adding every single piece in orange has ever existed. There we go. <laughs> Burgerpiss says, oh my god, I totally did not just take a nap. I mean, I think the nap must have, it can't have been more than 15 minutes, Carrie, don't worry. You, you should probably go to sleep though. <laughs> If you're finding thyself an involuntarily napping. Wait, what? Oh, I've missed a step. Hold up. Reverse, reverse. I think we just. <clears throat> I think this is just what we're doing. It should be fine. Yes. It was fine after all. We're making, I think, a conveyor belt or like a loading bay. I'm unsure at the present, but there we go. It looks like some sort of loading bay. Are you streaming in 1080-60p? <laughs> Am I streaming in 1080-60p? No, it doesn't do that. But the best I can do is... Oh, no, I don't want to stop. Hold up. Let's get acquainted personally. Hi, how do you do? You obviously wanted to see my face this of place. I am absolutely certain and I'm sure you're delighted to see this absolute gorgeous angle. Mm, let me see. Uh, na, 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 na. No, the, this is the best I can do. Like it's 30 frames a second and then very varying speeds because of my internet. But this is definitely the best I can do. I am sorry. It's fine. I just did it. It's all good. I tried. I failed. We're professionals here, people. Absolute professionals. I think this is basically where the forklift is going to be like loading the crate into. Or at least that's, that it, that's what it seems like to me. Oh, interesting. So this is the same technique that they use on the diner where like if this is all tiled in a moment to kind of create like a nice shape around the windows that's exactly what the diner does as well that's exactly what we're doing which i thought so yes that's a technique that the diner uses as well it's just that the diner has like a curved side as well not just like it doesn't have just the square so when you add these windows in Like, they're like sort of framed by the lime green, which is quite nice. Da, 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 da. Oops. Clickety click. Okay. Oh, we're making more crates. Oh, good, because I thought that was a bit sad if there was only one. But we're making a second one. This one is filled with all the bottles that I seem to keep dropping on the floor. Good at least they're attached and also these bottles are really quite expensive pieces so that's quite nice hold up come on there you go it's so posh very nice ah, we're attaching this this is being sold in the store okay Da, 
starting to be a star. Ooh. Evening says Carol. Hello, Carol. How do you do? Oh, no, I didn't talk to you, Alexa. Oh, apparently we're putting um, baguettes into bins. That is apparently the, the look we're going for here. Delicious. Grab your bread from your nearest build. Um, Brett from Baron says, hello, hello, hello. I miss the amazing streams. Johanna is such a real build that's looking amazing. I appreciate all the vlogs. Oh, thank you so much, Brett from Baron. That's, that's actually really good to hear. That's very nice. Um, actually, I had a bit of a meltdown today in the city and I taught, I, I mean, I started adding to it as I needed to after I finished my, like, old build of the Sanctum Sanctorum, which, again, spoiler alert, um, effectively isn't possible because one of the pieces that when you, like, old build it, it's the wedge for, like, the corner, like, sloped roof doesn't actually exist in the right orientation. It only comes in the left orientation in the colour of sand green. Ugh which is really annoying but that's not going to stop me from having any old build alteration because like I need it in that way so yeah that was a fun thing to find out <laughs> yeah yeah but anyway you win you win some you lose some I guess <laughs> Ooh, okay we're building a chiller aisle this is funny this is effectively what I just build in my mock okay but we have a chilled fish counter I like the bits that you get in the set, like, it's, I know this is expensive if you buy it full price, but there is a lot of really nice pieces in the set, like bread and fish and like all kinds of useful like elements. Look how cute this is. So fun. This is, I still have two bags to go. It's actually really nice. Actually, rather delightful. Perfect. Next bag. Keep this amazingness going. Hell yeah, I'm ready. Lay it on. Ooh, look, it's a new print for the for the computer screen. Slightly different. Cool. Right, we have lime green pillars, which is fun. Somebody said, just find a different colour panel and then build a mock of a roofing truck of the st street outside. And pretend it's a patch. <laughs> I mean, I could. I know they do it in like um, dark tan so and, and in white. They don't, they're not, and they're not very expensive pieces. So I'm just probably going to get a dark tan one because it's like the one that sits underneath. You don't actually see that much of it. So I will be able to live with it for now. I'm just like a, s a slight bit sad about it because, you know not perfect you know and if it's not perfect I don't like it <laughs> but maybe sometimes I need to just have slightly more chill you know but can you just like tell my brain that because I don't think my brain is like up for not being perfect um attach this one more brick Ooh. So, you just build this thing, which you attach, where, you know where, like, the crates come in? It's on the side. It's like when you come up with your little, oh no, forklift accident already. So when you come up with your forklift and you, like, put it here, come on, I'm trying to show you this, it will, like, push that up and then, oh, that's really fun. Look, and then you can just like grab it off here and then get all close. That's a really nice little touch. That makes it really playable. I'm very much appreciative of that. When I mock this into something, will I keep that? Probably not, but it's still cute, okay? Still cute. All right, let's make this into a slightly more building. So far, even though there aren't like a huge amount of pieces, I have, like, it does feel like there's a lot of big elements in this. I'm not gonna lie, like there is actually legitimately quite a large amount of elements that are big in the set so i can see why it's a little bit more pricey and there's some custom molds as well like it's it's 
kind of impressive, really. Like, if I'm trying to be completely the sort of unbiased in that sense, it is kind of impressive, you know? Corvette, hello! Why does my Alexa keep thinking that I talk to it? I'm not talking to you. You speak a thing. No, not you. Um. Wow, how blind can you be when like this massive brick escapes your notice? <laughs> ah. So this is where we're at at the moment. So fancy. Wow. I just. The, I've already like made gotten my plaster stuck between the bricks like twice in this build. I I know you can't see it, but it's it's quite funny. Keep getting my finger stuck, you know. Very helpful. Um, I think we're gonna just be creating the roof line so we can start attaching some of the roofing details promised by this amazing set, like the really big carrot above the doorway and stuff. Two, three, four, five. Ooh, you're building a Christmas set? Oh my god, I got so close to buying that in Glasgow. Like, so close. I just can't right now, but it was honestly, it's just so beautiful. Um, I've got various mock, plan mock plans for it in the city because I really like the colours of it and they're because they're like smaller buildings they lend itself really well to mocks and just they look awesome so also the, especially the, the one that is the music shop I really like the colours um, the dark red the, the, the olive green like mwah, beautiful just beautiful this is an odd build. What am I building? What am I building? Oh, I'm building an ATM apparently. Apparently I'm building an ATM. For oh, that's why we have that new printed tile, like the computer screen like tile. Let me show you. Let me attach the final few slopey slopes and show you this interesting new design of an ATM wall. Interesting. Oh, and you can even like I think it has a play feature. I don't know what it is yet, but it will have a play feature by the looks of it. I guess it's just to like put the notes through. But yeah. Like it's inside the store. Ooh, we're building, we're building a chilled aisle. Hell yes. I'm losing my voice. Why am I losing my voice? Ooh. Ah, water. Very lovely. I may just ask for the Christmas set for Christmas. That would be such a nice little thing to get for Christmas and then like have it as a Christmas build. That'd be perfect. Right, if you're building a chilled aisle, again, this set is great. There's like two milks and two orange juices and like so many little details, which if you like detailed minifigure sized things, this is perfect. Again, I'll show you in like two seconds. There we go. Um, we're doing two levels of that. So next level is, wait, is that honey that we're building? Hold up, honey in the chilled aisle? Interesting. That doesn't seem correct. 
But these two orange juices are, and I like that they're printed. There's actually a surprisingly small amount of stickers in a set, but it still feels super detailed. And there is like, so far, one, two, three, four, five, six, six prints. So that's quite good. Knocking things over. Yeah, so these are the like honeys, I guess. I'll show you. I don't really think what else it can be, to be honest. They have like even like a yellow lid. Doop, doop. Oh no, oh no. no. The milk escaped. Not the milk. So, look, how nice is that? And then that kind of blocks in the hole that you had with the ATM, so it just kind of sits there. Honestly, it's made, like the, the, the store itself feels like nicely stocked, but still very spacious to walk around, which it's actually really lovely. It's very lovely. I'm very much enjoying the set. Much more, even more than I thought I would, even though I knew I really liked the set. So far, can definitely recommend it. Do get it at a discount though. I think it's worth the money that they, that it costs to be fair, more so than some other sets because of the amount of large elements in it. But yeah, still, if you can get it on a discount, it's definitely even more worth it. Um, wait, I... Oh no, floopity floop 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 floop. What did I miss? I missed. I missed attaching a one by one. Luckily, that's easily remedied. And then we're just attaching these to the side. So that's bag three done. So we've got this is like a more finished facade. Obviously these two are gonna be used to attach the base plates. And then the interior is starting to look nice and finished. I doubt we're adding more to this just because I think with the amount of stuff that we still need to add to the top of this building, I don't think bag four is gonna hold much more interior detail for us, but it's very cute. Let's build a giant carrot. Ah! Giant carrot time. Oh, 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 giant carrot time. Oh my god, there's so many... Guys, you don't understand. I know this is an expensive set of £55 or whatever it is in dollars, but the amount of large elements in every single one of these bags is insane. Like, it's all huge. <laughs> If you do have to buy this full price, I think it's worth it. It's actually a really, really sweet set. Okay. Like, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. There's like five in this set. What? Oh, look at it just. And also the green is just like a really nice colour. It's so vibrant, but not like too in your face. Is that like, yeah, that's what I mean. Not too in your face. Wow, shiny. Oh, oops. I got a bit too excited there. <laughs> made them all one by fours but I was like two by fours but one was meant to be a one by two and then we finished the whole row with these huge two by four slopes which are massive again and then some very big green tiles which are just fantastic 
very very much like them i wish they were one by six they're really rare and i need one for a build but oh look at that wow now let's finish off the other sides of the build as well and um, two one by fours two one by eights and now like the top straight away feels like much more polished and because it still does have that like air like um edge here you can very easily just like make it into a modular if you want to just from here and then we're going to be touching some signs let's do it let's do it Oh, it looks like we will be making some more it, like stands because there is apples and flowers <gasps> it's corn oh my god it's super cute oh it's really nice it's so detailed and there's a rumor of like a new plant piece coming as well it's so nice it's so nice can't imagine a more beautiful thing Apologies for anybody that I've annoyed with that. I'm I'm cruising. It's sorry. I just caught that question, Gordon. I can't really read the like question, like the chat, because like my phone is so far away and it's quite small. Hugh, what did you ask? I'm sorry. Westy, Gordon, Johanna's in Lego mode. I am in Lego mode. <laughs> um. Oh, Hugh, hello, have you become, oh, I'm so sorry. I don't know why, but my bloody, like, um, my notifications aren't working either, so you can't even get the welcome. But thank you very much for joining again, Hugh. I think that is what that said. I will go into the settings in a minute in the Discord when I finish the stream and make you a member on there, because if you haven't, like, automatically linked your Discord to YouTube, it won't realize, so I have to manually do that. But thank you for joining. Much appreciate. Apologies that I missed that. I cannot see. Like, it doesn't even do a different colour for any notification. It's just like, ah, uh, it's a bit annoying. It's only for now. Hopefully, so Ben started his new job today, which should hopefully mean that uh, by next week I can steal his computer and actually have my proper setup again if the ancient uh, game capture cards technology works. I you know we've got to hope for these things people got to got to hope right we have attached a giant carrot ladies and gentlemen this is all we've ever wanted giant carrot time i repeat giant carrot time oh 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 giant carrot time Hell yeah, look at this. It's so cool. <laughs> very nice, very nice indeed. Um, exciting, hope Ben likes his new job. Well, so um, effectively he's been doing the job for about three years. It's just now he's actually going to be full-time employed rather than just doing it for free in his own time. So yeah, it's, I, I think it'll be fine. <laughs> like he's... He's done it, basically. Um, but yeah, so he's he's not at home at the moment. He is down in Devon, which is funny because we drove back from Scotland yesterday and today he's down in Devon. He's legitimately crossing the country. Um, poor boy, having to do so much driving, but he'll survive. It'll be okay. Um, ooh, more crates. We're going to get a crate that is half... Oh! Oh, I know what this crate is. It's not an ATM. It's like where you return your empty bottles. I don't know if that's how common that is. It's not common in the UK, but like in the Netherlands and Germany and stuff, all your bottles that you buy, both glass as well as plastic, you pay extra for like 50p, 20p, 10p, depending. And then when you return the bottle empty, 
you go, you put it through like a machine and it gives you your money back. In, in Netherlands, it's called Statiegeld. And it's awesome because it means that you can, like, as a child, like, put the bottles in a thing and it's like, it like slopes up and it's really fun. But I think it's not an ATM. It is one of those machines because you put, like, one of those bottle things behind it and you have enough room to put it through in the front. That's so cool. But yeah, that may be a bit lost on non-mainland Europeans. I don't even really know, but yeah. Right, and then these are the fruit crates for outside. In by the windows. Because we'll be adding some fruit in here. Fruit, beautiful, beautiful fruit. Ah, yeet the banana. Oops. I yeeted the banana and it went everywhere. Oh no. To be fair, I do that in real life often enough. Okay, here is a carrot. Oh my gosh, I want to show you the corn pieces. It's so cute. Adding the carrots. Adding the corn. How cute is this? Oh my god, it is so good. Thank you, Zantic Dragon. Also, hi. That is a great suggestion. Let's hydrate. Ah, oh, water. So refreshing. Refreshing. I think it's nearly done. It's nearly done. Ooh, first of all, we get to try the new plant piece. Much excite. Ooh, it's so shiny. I hope they do like a million recolors of this because it's really cute. So here we have the new plant stand. This one we use some buckets for apparently. We're going to be putting it next to the store. Oh, and it will hold, oh, that's so cute. It will hold some flowers, some bouquet flowers. Stop putting my thing. Oh, so annoying. Keep putting my plaster in between the bricks. All of the time. Okay, and then we're gonna be attaching the solar panels to the roof. Even more printed elements, just by the by. The parking sign, another printed element. Amazing. Amazing. And then we're just attaching some things here. Oh, they even give instructions as to how to like detach plates if you don't want like them to be in a certain orientation. And you can use a carrot for it. How sensible. Oh, you know, your nails. Who needs nails anyway, right? Am I right? I know. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay, right, so. Oh, it says, oh, lol, I, I realized that I just did those instructions just from the picture rather than the actual instruction steps. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Look, and then we can attach this. It's very dangerous, Johanna. Come on, that's actually really awesome. I think it's really cool. I need to... Ah. Ah. So yeah, we've got... Um, oh, those are the bouquets. To be fair, they were likely to fall out. But yeah, look. A really nicely filled store with like the collection for the bottles. You've got some buy some like drinks. The only thing that's a bit tricky to use is... Um, Hand of UK sit in that, like it works, but they fall out if you move it too quickly. This play feature is actually really fun. It's so sweet, I love it. 
Also, obviously, this minifigure is amazing. I really like this mus dude's moustache. Like, very posh. Very posh indeed. This, so happy. I'm glad that you've reused that costume, actually. Super, super cute. And then, look at this shopping trolley. Ah. Anybody on the fence about this set, it's so worth it. There are so many, like, minifigure size details in this. Um, so many adorable things. So many massive elements. The colours are really nice. I think it will blend in really well if you want to mock it. It's, like, really, really nice. So, God ask how I'm going to add this to my city. I don't know yet, if I'm really honest. Um, originally, I was just going to build on top of it and, like, have, like, a probably dark tan building on top of it. But, um... The city is a bit of a sore point in my mind right now. It's just not, it's just not working out. It's just not coming together and it's actually just, ah, uh, it's really frustrating. I could really do with like some eyes on it. Honestly, it's, it's actually really difficult as, as I really, really used to adore my city. I know now at the moment, it's just not quite where I want it to be and I can't seem to make it work and I have many grand plans, but they're all a bit too grand for like the bricks and the resources that I've got at the moment. So, you know, they look great in my head. So I want to make them work, but also I can't make them work. So I have to settle for less and I find that really difficult. So yeah, the city is a bit of a slow point right now. I'm sure I'll get that. Give me some time. Give me like a month and we'll see where we're at. Um, hopefully, <laughs> fingers crossed. All right, how much is it? Uh, this set is 55 pounds in the UK, but I got it for 45, I think, 43 in Smiths. But it, I don't think it's gonna be around for very long. Some people say it's retiring. Some other people say it's not retiring. It is unsure for now. But if you can get it on a discount, remember Black Friday is coming really soon. So like, this is probably one of the sets that may be included in discounts. Keep your ass peeled. Ah, sorry. Ooh. So yeah. This was much fun. Rusty said, I've seen an offer for 40. Yeah, 40 would be like super worth it. Honestly, it looks quite scant. And yeah, I know you're paying for the base plate of like the, you know, the road plate, but there's a lot of really good elements in this set that are genuinely worth it. So yeah, if you can get it for like 45 or below, you're doing good. That's pounds, by the way. Dollars. I don't know what, it's, what it goes for in dollars. I guess if you can get it for like $55, you're doing really great, but I don't really know what this original retail price is in dollars um for years um actually let me show you my city oh hello hello good oh good day i can switch the camera around there we go so this is this is what the city is like right now <laughs> i had to move all the dumping ground um as i was busy for the stream but yeah i'll do a video on it obviously but that's just that is just the mess I'm looking at. <laughs> marvellous. Marvellous indeed. Alrighty, I think I'm going to leave it there. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed that. I know it was quite strict. It was only an hour and ten, but like, this is an easy set to build. But it was really fun. And I hope that Long Pig and Giraffe enjoyed it too. Long Pig. Um, yes. Have to get the else. Elf Club has to build. Can't wait to start it. Ooh, that is a really nice set, actually. I'd love that. That would be much excited. Oh, um, Gordon says it's currently $54 on Amazon in the US. Um, that seems a absolute fantastic thing to get. Um, $2 from Tyson. Hashtag Dionja. Woo! <laughs> Thanks, Tyson. <laughs> um, mm -mm -mm -mm. Hit that like button, yo. Yeah. Gordon says, Johanna, can you talk to us? on your other side camera for a moment uh maybe yes i could but i don't know if i'm aiming it out of my face in that in that hello i'm talking to you on the other side camera right now i mean as you're not seeing my face i'm sure you have absolutely no idea if it's actually synced or not but left right i know i'm opposite direction zoom into the sanctum sanctorum zoom out of the sanctum sanctorum Everybody on the stream is like, what the hell have I just tuned into? Um, people are leaving. <laughs> um, 
Right, so thank you very much for being here, you lovely people. I have a review of the Sanctum Sanctorum coming very soon, as well as a Scotland adventure, which is amazing, and I cannot wait to show you because not only was there damage done in the Lego store, just a little bit, and I met up with a lovely subscriber. I also went to the Highlands and it's awesome. So yeah, I will see you very soon. Um, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Au revoir. How do Bye bye. Stop.